Hello there everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover and thank you for joining me here at the start of a new campaign in the mod called North America Divide in which we're playing as my home state, the state of the Republic of North Carolina led by some guy named John C.B. Ringhouse. But, my friends, we got to begin with some elections. With the ending of Ehringhouse's term, the man not seeking re-election must now hold elections this year in order to pick our new national leader. With another four years have passed since the last and truly final American election, the people of the NC State have decided to continue the tradition of four-year terms and are now looking to elect a new leader. The candidates are as follows. Clyde R. Hoey, a former North Carolina representative who is running with a Democratic Party. William Dudley Pelley, a dude, an author from Massachusetts, who resides in Asheville and is running with a self-proclaimed Silver Legion of America and Paul Crouch, an activist and former soldier running with a county party. Say the uh, Democrats? Uh, Pelley, he seems, like a, he seems like a good guy. He seems really eccentric. We like him. You know, oh. Oh, does it? Do these not auto? Oh, that's kind of. I thought you know you choose one, the other one wouldn't be able to do it. But this one has a big L on it, so we'll go with Mr. L. Oh, and there's nothing to read here. Okay, S L A. Oh, it's part of a party. Cool. Um, let's see anything else here. Doctrine cost. It's not really worth it. Can only get about one political power a day. So with this mod, every all the states are out and having a good old time. Oh wow, look out! You can go so far north. Wow. Um. So yeah, North Carolina does have a unique focus tree. And uh, with Pelly, we're gonna have a good old time. Does, does Greenland have a focus tree? Christian the tenth of Denmark. They do. Diplomatic endeavors. Wow. Cool. But yeah, we're playing as North Carolina. We got some big goals for this campaign. If you can't tell, we got some big old goals. We want the Silver Legion, and we'll go solidify control next. Give us some more political power, because eventually, by God's grace, we're gonna have the Night of God's Wrath and have a liberation doctrine, my friends. It's, someone's gonna rule all. And which we get the true enemy of America, uh, synthetic research, and we're also eventually going to reclaim the South. So expand the realm, go and invade Florida. Uh, uh, something going to be reborn and parade through the former capital. Oh, you betcha! Because eventually we are going to form. I can buy weapons too. That's kind of different. The United State of Carolina. So I do want to take out them South Carolinians as fast as possible. But we'll see what happens. You know, no guarantees. Also, Mexico is divided up as well, which is fine. Oh, there's Venezuela and Colombia, but no one cares about them. The Second Red River War. Texas and Oklahoma. Oh. Also, I think I left this on A Historical, so we'll see what happens. Oh. Oh, wow. Do we have factions yet? The Jeffersonian League. Jeffersonian League. Okay, cool. Mississippi uh, Confederacy. Oh, look at... Oh, he was influenced. <gasps> An army. Rebellious black rebels. Backwoods Educations. Rum Ranning Rampant. Biloxi Affair. Oh, look at this. Squads? I love squads. Crush party system. Propaganda campaign. Sounds like fun to me. White kids. Also, I think I think the South, not all the South, but the South generally has quite a few uh, um, focus trees. Actually, just South. Because we have one. And, yeah, South Carolina does as well. It's not as impressive, but, yeah. Cock fighting day. Let's see, Georgia, because I know someone wants me to play Georgia. Ed Rivers is a deal broker, an experienced lawyer. Corrupt highway department. Low priced hogs. He was influenced. Oh, wow, look at this. Oh, yeah, that, that's just going to look like a lot of fun. Red wine, huh? Cool. Georgian economy. Oh, a, cu a couple rallies up there. Liberia plant. Actually, what's it? Oh, it's in Alabama. Wow, that is a flag. Guards, rebels. Um, highway project. Alabama Army. Old Cotton Tom. So I, I've not checked any of this stuff at all. So I don't know really what's going to happen. Democratic Rooster, huh? Thank the mothers? Oh, good God. we got to thank some mothers. Denounce the Yanks? The Catholic question. Admiral Uprising. Back off issue. Jeff Jeffersonian Democrat dominance. Greater Euphoria. Regency. Police squads. Cool. Big Jim. Also, uh, I'm not sure who's getting... Ooh, uh, share the wealth, that's kind of cool. But over here in Texas... Oh, they're getting smashed in the north from Oklahoma. It looks like. That could be wrong, but... Led by James Allred. But it's really cool, because you can have uh, Union Storm Austin. Get some Texas Rangers. Allred wins the election. You can get Miriam A. Ferguson. You can get LBJ. You can get uh, W. Leo Daniel. And Hiram Wesley Evans, which... i got to go down that route as well. But i got to stop... Paying attention to other states and focus on North Carolina, a Tar Heel state. Jonas Evans looks cool. I don't think we really need him. Oh, and you're here already. Cool. Uh, let's see. What's this? Ooh, oh, more daily. Oh, we could use more daily army XP. 
We go straight to war economy, though. Mm, that's pretty strong. You know what? There's not. We can't really make too much right now. How many consumer goods are we losing? Thirty-four percent. Five can be used. You know what? Let me grab this guy first. I want to get some more daily army speed to start working on our land auction more first. We definitely, 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 absolutely need it. Um, Stain goes over here. General max army size. Artillery attack. What? Wallace Whitfield R Riddick Jr. Cool. You're offensive. And stay offensive. We like you offensive. Cool, so that stuff is going on. We're grabbing some of this stuff as well, which would be very nice. Um, cool. Also, in these episodes, I do like to win a play of states, because there's another state mod. Is it North America Divided? I don't think it was. Maybe it was North America Divided. I can't remember. But, like, I always like to ask questions like regarding a particular state, because I've played as Texas before. I think I played as California as well. Oh, there goes Oklahoma. They're not doing so well now anymore. But for this, uh, oh, the Tar Hill Empire. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, look, we changed the flag. But I do want to ask you guys a question. For this episode, North Carolina is named in honor of whom? Who is, or what, or who, or North Carolina is named in honor of who? Please let me know in the comments below. Now, do we incorporate the opposition? Or do we purge opposition? I think purges are in order. Cool. Now work on me. Nice. Slightly more fuel. Um, purchase weapons would not be bad. That's 4,000 units ain't bad. Honestly, if we could use that, it's, it is 90. But we do need divisions, so you know what? We're going to lose a lot of factory. Screw it. We're going to do this one instead. We need the stability because we're going to lose it anyway, so that'll be goal. And this one, do by God's grace. But let's see. What else do we have in the focus? So we're going down this route. We also have the Holy Presidency with Oppose Huey Long, Uphold Democracy, Open Secretaries to, or Universities to other places. Refugee for Jewish Science. Southern Defense Council, so really even less, kind of like a conf confederacy type, I guess you'd say. Pro Huey Simps. Join Jeffersonian League. Distribute the wealth. Every man a king. Ellen Dawson. Huh. Nationalized tobacco industry. Control over South Carolina tobacco industry as well. Rowlett Project. Develop the mounts. Mass populist propaganda. Also, we do have a cup of coffee here as well. And that's and there's stuff over here too. Celebrated military history, which is not bad. Promote our officers' tradition, which is pretty good. Arms purchased from civilians. That's not bad. Establish our navy. Destroy our effort. Cool. I don't think the navy's gonna be super important here, but we'll see. By God's grace, this mod does not move too slow though, which is very nice. Honestly, you know what? Buy the weapons, because I want a bigger army out. Because I want to form a state of Carolina, United State of Carolina. Which way are they going to, by the way? Not democratically by Johnston? Now, South Carolina red shirts. <laughs> a cucked governor. <laughs> of course, we have Tennessee over here. Browing. 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 Huh? By God's good grace. But God's... Night of God's wrath. I kind of wish it was descriptions here. Uh, now, South might not be done yet, but you know what? I wanted to play as my home state anyways. Ooh, we're going to need some arty. And, oh my goodness, these guns are not good. We get bicycles? So that's kind of cool. Still build up. Build, 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 build. Actually, how many divisions do they have? Because they're training our navy as well. They're pretty very. Oh my gosh, they might have a bigger military than us. Oh, would that be so bad? Three and three. Train. Okay, so we have enough guns for now. We're making four divisions in total. This is the combat that we're using already. It's not bad, not great, but not bad. But after Night of God's Wrath, we're going to have enact Liberation Doctrine. Actually, we're going to go to war with them. Is there a quicker way? Mercenaries. Negotiate volunteer forces. Huh. Alright. So, focus on foreign affairs. Ah, expand the realm. Reclaim the south. Oh, we just get a war goal on them anyways. Or we could just move in now. But it doesn't look like we're really ready. Maybe we don't necessarily have to be ready, perhaps? Eh, I don't know. 254 days. It's probably just best to wait, maybe. A night of terror. Late last night, screams of terror could be heard as thousands of civil ships connections uh, uh, marched through the streets of Raleigh, attacking anyone who had connection to the Union of Comrades, a comms a fiercely anti pelly organization. <clears throat> While demonstrations throughout the city have been occurring regularly since the ascension of the Legion of Power, they'd never been seen on this magnitude. Anyone who was outside of the town was a potential target, with demonstrators brutally beating, mugging, and in some cases executing suspected hoeists, as they called them. When news reached Pelly about the riots, he hesitated to call for action, only doing so after hearing an explosion not too far from where he was staying. After all was said and done, 13 were killed with countless more injured and millions of dollars of damage. They had it coming. What do you want? They had it coming. 
Armor. It's not bad. I'm gonna get some more army XP immediately. The Dakota Wars. Fighting over grass? Oh, the Dakotas are killing each other. Yeah, there's not really much here. There's not like any extra political power we can grab that I really care about. The Great Ohio River Flood. Well, that sucks for y'all. Yeah, at this point, we must just grab a. Uh... Oh, we get some armor. We don't have any armor, though. We suffer more from attrition than anything else. So we get point nine two. Ain't too bad. Um, other than that, maybe we get a reduction in land auction costs. And control of the media. Better justify war goals times. AI modifier focus on offense. An offensive war penalty stability modifier plus 10%. Ain't bad. Wow. Well, South Dakota's doing well, but just because the tiles are really big in North Dakota. And of course, we have California here, led by, was it Miriam? Yeah, Frank Miriam. Texas is. Oh, they have a truce. Oh! They lost. Did they lose? No. Yes? Yeah. Yeah. What the heck? They lose. They lost and won. Hey! Look at this guy. Poor motorization, incompetent industries, swamp folk, Louisiana officers, Arc Latex. Very cool. Alright, grab some of that there stuff. Um, engineers would be nice. Uh, armor trains, maybe, because you don't want to forget about them train boys. Ooh, look at that, yes. And I'm not really sure what's the best one to choose. I think Grand Battle Plan's a lot of fun. Fear firepower ain't bad. But you know what? Because we're going to go with Pelly, he's got grand plans. So I think grand battle plan probably be the best because he's got grand plans, right? It only makes sense to me. What the heck? Come on. I hope no one else goes to war with us before we go to war with these uh, South Carolinians. So control the media. Because why not? Better already? Yes, please. Nice. Oh, yeah, Florida here is too. But I don't think there's anything about like a Florida man here. Schultz on a Florida reformer. That's kind of cool. The election let democracy win. Big Ben Air Base and bought Daniel Schultz for a speech. Southern Unity. Claim West Florida. Or Red Crone radio speech, huh? Cancel them elections. Clear the Caribbean Republic. Throw a Caribbean dollar. Well, my friends, I guess we we'll have to wait and see what happens here. This looks almighty interesting. But now we got more divisions out, which is very nice too. Are we out of guns? Yes, sir. Yes, we are. Could we buy a few more guns? No, we can hire mercenaries though. Control the media. Followed up with Pelly Ruzal. Oh, you bet he do. He does, he does, he does. Focus on foreign affairs. Um, that would be nice. Not really super needed, but yeah, that would help. Um, perfect Christianity. Spreading his teachings. Oh, I love it when he spreads his teachings. A true enemy of America, silver, each... Oh, we get weekly map up, plus 50. Expand the realm. I do want to go to war as fast as possible. Let's focus on foreign affairs. It's only 21 day focus, which is very, very nice. Um, can't buy any more guns. Why? I like buying guns. As long as we can hold the line, that's all I really care about too much. How's supply doing? Because this is updated with the No Step Back a DLC, so as you can see, we're going to choo choo around here. Not bad. And the mountains will be. Oh, you're not connected. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, you're connected here, so we need to get Greenville so we can have some supply through here. I mean, it's not bad right now, but still. But still. And we also have what, Mississippi, Arkansas, Little Rock. Oh, that's a red Little Rock. Haciendas. Wow. Pinkerton Agency to investigate STFU. Alright. Railway guns. Nothing like a, a tar heel. Railway gun. Pally speech. There's no time that is more important in our nation's, young nation's history than right now for. We have the chance to become something great. Something that our ancestors would be proud of. We can achieve a level of glory that most can only ever dream of. To do it, though, we'll require each and every one of you to put in your share of the work, for nothing short of your hardest will suffice. We must focus on ourselves, purifying the state of any imperfections, imposing the teachings of Jesus Christ among all the peoples of a great nation. Once we, are, once we are impure, we must work on creating a fighting force so strong that nobody would dare to oppose it. Finally, we will lead a brilliant and quick campaign against our enemies, restoring southern glory. Only then shall we have achieved greatness. Let's get to work, my friends. Get to work. Mm, that's not bad to do, but anything from the military? I want more army XP. Like, I'm a sucker for army XP, and we need a lot of it. 
Get some armor trains, you son of a gun. Focus on foreign affairs. We definitely need some speed to expand the realm. Greenville weapons plants. So that's actually pretty good, too. Church state. Oh, there's a church state? Oh, I'm going to play, play this mod probably a whole bunch, just because this is, there's just so much you can do here, it looks like. Yeah, I'm not going to last very long for each campaign, but that's okay. Are you a pope? Luis Maria Martinez. Deal the Hacienda. Deal the Civil War. Oh, boy. Fight for freedom. Moderate support. God's, God's War. <gasps> yes, abolish sex education. Oh, good news. Expand the realm. Ah, I love having control of the media. Nothing like it. We need some more vampires as well, so. So we have volunteer only. Militia men. You get 1% more recruitable population. That's actually really cool. 5%. Eh, sure, why not. Fighters, thank you. Get some more output as well. I know our industry is not the greatest, but. It has to suffice. We can't even cover our entire front line yet. Yeah, it's not looking good for us right now. As long as we can make encirclements, that's the biggest thing. Just making encirclements is the most important thing to do. Capture another military factory and we get some artillery. So we can make enemies go really big boom boom boom. <clears throat> That'd be nice. <clears throat> and reclaim the south, march west. Oh, we get cores on them. Reclaim the south. Attack the north. We might have to do that too, but march west. Republic against Republic of Tennessee, huh? Final through the mountains going to kind of suck. I always like the Tennessee flag. I, oh, I, I somewhat always liked it, just because Trump. Uh, uh, just because it's not centered with that little line there, but volunteer state. For, oh my gosh. First cavalry, very nice. Yeah, these ships ain't too good. Reclaim the south, my friends. March west. Ally Huey. Attack the Jeffersonians. Wow. Invade Florida. Triumph in Louisiana. Par partition the south. The Confederacy reborn. Well, after that stuff, I do want to focus on domestic affairs. That'd probably be really good for us. Good use of manpower. Hmm. Resistance growth speed goes down. Uh, silver shirt legions would be very good to get as well. But we need factories. Let's go to the tank plant first. Now, nah, we're going to get some cities first. There you go. Well, this might go very poorly for us. And in fact, it probably will. But, we'll see what happens. Although, what have they got? A citadel. Oh. Oh, that's true. I've heard about the citadel. Well, everyone, you saw me go to war. But now it's 1939, July 5th. Just a day after a great day, and uh, yeah, we didn't do so well, but now we're here, right? We've lost about 11,000. Killed off quite a few South Carolinians, but these guys are really, really tough, actually. Actually, they have up to 29 divisions. We got 19, and we've done okay. Like, well, I've had the enemy just kind of run into our lines quite a bit. Wait. Sherman Land. What's going on over here? What is the Socialist Republic of Douglas? Henry Winston. Arkansas Volunteers, Senate former Army. Huh. Okay, well, they got stuff going on down there. We got Frank Dixon. And then y'all got the Negro Free State faction name. Ned Cobb. Oh, wait. People's Republic of Bermuda. Well, Jersonian League. Faction name, Communist 6 1. The Grand Claverns of America. Oh, they didn't go that one that way. Look at that. You get exactly 67 weekly manpower. What the heck? Oh, we have the Western Defense Initiative? Of course. Yeah, it's basically the Pacific States of America. Hey, Arizona. Arizona Rangers. Anything else around here that we really care about? Uh, no. Northwestern Territories? The Democrat... Okay, yeah, who cares about New York? Oh, Mexico. No. Now, this is a Mexico I always hear of. Some really short guy named Emilio. Cool. But yeah, as you can see, they're, they're definitely trying to push this out. Uh, luckily, though... Because I've been able to, like, edit our divisions. They have no manpower. Also, I made the infantry 20 combo with artillery and engineers. As well as the cavalry, but they're only 18 combo with, so. This has definitely helped out a lot more than I thought it would. Because we're, we're actually kind of under... Inferior in terms of, like, being able to kill these enemies off. Like, holy crap. Like, South Carolina is tough. They are a tough little bunch of crazies down here. 
That's why we want him. Yeah, would you look at that? Yeah, go in immediately. Don't give him a chance to do anything questionable. Just in case, head on down here if you can. Just make sure we don't get encircled. Oh, they wanted to encircle us. Oh, we got... Oh, we lost that battle. Oh, god dang it. Come on, come on. Oh, no! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It literally makes no sense. Hold. They might move around. Let them move around. Take another towel. Because the more they spread out, the weaker their defenses become, which is good, 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 good. George Shona. Hmm. It's fine. Can't go there. That's fine. It's pretty swampy, I bet. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. If anything, uh, go here. What? Alright, well, we'll do that, and then we'll do this as well. Alright, and those guys are gone. Carolina Cruiser. Also, I've done a lot of focuses. So, I've done, um, Perfect Christianity, Spread His Teachings, Focus on Domestic Affairs, Reclaim the South, of course, March West. Let's do the True Enemies of America first, though. Or next, I guess. Really, just next. Can you see an operative capture? That ain't good. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how their soldiers are so strong. Oh, we did go down Grand Battle Plan, but still. We lost 15,000. Let's see, anything else here? We could use some more command power, of course, but, you know, whatever. Uh, let's go with that's up next. Let's see. Alright, it's time to take Spartanburg. It's time for them to learn their lesson. Construction 3 is nice. Get some more construction as well. Recon. Nice. It's 1939. Maybe get some logistics just in case. Takes a little bit of time. They're still going to be attacking us quite a bit. Yeah. We just need the, we just need the state. Okay. And uh, honestly, I'm a little surprised that no one else has tried to kill us off yet. So, it's actually really good for us. If you guys go down to Georgetown. That'd be very, very nice as well. Go, 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 go. Come on. Why do they have so many divisions in South Carolina? They don't have nearly as much population as North Carolina does. Ay, ay, ay. And here's the... Uh, we actually have a good amount of equipment. We just need more support equipment. That's really all we need. Um, I'd love to just push, but pushing just does, no does nothing. You need to encircle. Greenville would be good to get, but they do have two forts down there. They've got a lot of forts down here as well. No, we're good for now, son. We're good for now. Oh, you just attacked? Oh, god dang it. They have too many divisions. Push, then. Ah, you know what's good. Don't push. Don't push. You guys come down here. No, you're going back down here. You both go down there. You're going to help hold the line. And you're going to help support the attack. Son! Come on. Yeah, I don't understand how three divisions cannot beat that other one up. It doesn't make any sense to me. Force it. I'd rather you die here. I, we gotta kill off some sort of enemy divisions here or something. How? There you go, finally. Kill them off immediately. Look at that. How? Well, I guess we make use, I guess it makes sense to use a lot of divisions like that. Thank God I got rid of, rid of another division. Yeah, I don't know why South Carolina is so flipping strong. Rooting out our imperfections. Why us? Darn them. Huh. Alright then. I think South Carolina honestly does need a little bit of America. But then again, I'll probably not say that when I do play them, but Silver Shirt Legions. Manpower would be nice. Stability would be nice too. Stability for the nation. They're going to throw in that extra division there, which is fine. Go, Calvary boys, go. Good. Because you're going to go in immediately next. I want you to follow them. Head south. Fast machine tools. Get some more instruction because you can. There you go. Good, good, good. And you're going to go this way. Take Charleston. Burn it to the ground. Yep. They have so many divisions all over the place. That's kind of ridiculous. Go in here, too. There you go. Nice. Hold. So these guys are not cut off just yet. 
Now they've been cut off. Hopefully we don't get cut off. We can attack anywhere else? No? It's good? They're moving in. As soon as they move in, we gotta attack and move in there. Actually, you can just go there. Good. Good. Come on. I wonder what doctrine they went down. Even better. Two divisions go bye bye as well. They have up to 20. Oh my gosh, 27 divisions. Holy crap. Um, up next, actually. You might as well go to limited conscription. There's no penalty to doing so. Actually, let's go to war industrials because I still want to get uh, more factories. I like some millies. It's pretty good, actually. Alright, so at this point, we still can't really just knock them out. It's kind of stupid. They must have mobilized more men. Yeah, they definitely did. Alright, not bad. We'll push all the way over here. You guys go here, go there. You guys can move fast enough that hopefully we can get this one done. We're no longer attacking in the north, which is good. Go, 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 Alright, so we cut them off. Hopefully the navy can do something here. Um, honestly, probably not, but you know, we'll try. This is my first campaign in this mod anyway, so. We'll give him a shot. Hopefully it's a good shot. We'll try. Try, 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 try. Come on. So for shirt legions, high, fun higher education? Yes, please. Alright, then we definitely need Charleston next. Keep these guys in place. We lost Alcolu. So, who's this? Little dicks. We lack little dicks. Why is little dicks? All of our little fascist influence. I don't know what they are doing here, but whatever. They are who they are, I guess. There we go. Now they should be starving for supplies. Or at least, you know, once the penalty starts kicking in. Head on down. Good, good, good. They can beat them up as much as they like over there. That ain't gonna win. No, no, sir. Kentucky is puppeted. Indiana did lose as well. Five divisions, good. Yeah, they're Indi Indiana's a puppet of whom? Paul V. McNutt. Indiana core communist influence. Ohio, of course. Ohio gang. Nice, nice thunderbolt there, son. Alright, so actually, if we go right here, that'd be better. Still making other encirclement. It's all about making them encirclements. Good, finally, we're things are on the upswing for us now. Good buy more guns. We're pretty good on guns on it already. Well. Aiken. Another two divisions go bye bye. I apologize for taking so long with this, but. Gotta start somewhere, right? It's already 1940. Holy crap. Logistics 1. Let's grab some more gun stuff. Good. Very nice. Well, time to go in. Fire on. Fun higher education. Attack the north. Yeah, you might as well start attacking the north. Let's see what we can do. Get Virginia. Good old Virginia. Beautiful. Cavalry is especially important for stuff like this. Piero. Hey, okay, so we finally won. Alright, so my bad for taking so long with that. That was actually really difficult to do. But it's for the United States of Carolina. Now we're nice purple. Carolina Empire. Hopefully our generals will have learned a lot. But now we're going to take out Virginia. Oh, we got some more factories. Oh, thank God. What do we need here? Support equipment. A lot more support equipment. And planes actually would be really good as well. We got the three. A little more motorized as well. Wow, we really changed the flag, didn't we? Also, uh, I need to take these guys off because I made it after I did this. Let me do that stuff. Kind of a waste of XP, but whatever. 
Terra Sounds. Very nice. So now that we actually have a relatively okay army, this is going to be by George C. Peary. Officers, Black Rebels, Diverse Economy, Mass Conscription Effort. Special Forces, Volunteers Allowed. They have a lot of manpower. Wow. And a ton of divisions. Doesn't mean they're any good, but they're probably not terrible. So, like earlier, let's go and try to save and see what happens. Now, at the very lack, at least, at least, at least, at least, form the Confederate States eventually, so. Go to war. Uh, I guess we have to wait. It's probably best to wait. How long would it take? Uh, that's not bad. 175 days ain't bad. Attack that there north. Ally here along. Fortified capital. Synthetic resources. Commando is not bad. Naval plan. It's all right. Field cells. Invade Florida. Attack the Jersey. Triumph in there. I, we got need, we need, we need them all. But fortify our capital first. Raleigh is a city of strategic and political importance. Fortifying it would help it not be taken over by vile enemies. And by God, do we got a lot of vile, vile enemies. Yeah, that's okay to do. So what would happen if we went to war with these guys? Would they immediately attack us? I'd imagine that they would. I've been wrong before. Because they're, they're stacking a lot of soldiers on the border. There they go. Oh, look at that. We're doing... Doing quite well. Danville. Oh, they have anti-tank. Huh. Doing okay so far. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, they got planes. Okay, all 6,000 of them already. Not bad. Up, up to 81 divisions. Well, that's better than 100 some. These guys definitely learning a lot, which is great, great, great. Oh, look at that. Yes, please. We're going to go infiltration. War propaganda would be very good as well. Just make sure you don't lose, you son of a rock sucker. And synthetic research. Sparta, huh? Hold on, you sons. Keep learning, keep learning. 93% of the way there, it's become an infantry leader, which is very good. Supplies are pretty bad over here, though. Hmm. I'd love to take Portsmouth, but whatever. 24,000 losses already? That's pretty good, actually. Look at that army speed. It's not nearly enough. It's not nearly enough yet. Naval Staff Chief of the Army. Go with Jonas Brown. Cool. Supplies looking okay. Independence. Good. And what's over here? Uh, oh, infantry leader. That's good. It's very good, actually. Quite good. Go back in there. There are 36,000 losses. Still not enough. They got plenty enough manpower, but still. Uh, Stockpile? Yeah, not as many divisions as I thought they would have. How's the Navy looking? Looking alright. Spire is kind of an issue. Lone Wolf. What over here? You got any things for us? No? No, not really. They are just murdering themselves. 42,000 losses so far. I love it. Supplies for us? Looking very good. 1940s other stuff? Artillery? Yes, please. And better planes? Oh, hello. Ooh, don't lose here either. I uh, know there's only one of y'all, but that's still okay. Uh, we'll go attack the bottom probably for this campaign. Virginia Beach. Never been. Maybe we'll go someday. But we'll see. Come on. Oh, God, no. There are too many people there. Which does make them want to attack us more. Which I'm kind of okay with. Go, horse boys. Go, go, go. Static research. Naval plan. Might as well. 56,000 losses so far. That ain't enough. Oh, they're running out of guns. Nice. Plenty of manpower. We got plenty of guns, too. And RT. RT? RT. We got plenty of RT. Oh, you're going back. You gotta go to Sparta, then. Let them move around a little bit. Let them try to attack us a little bit again. What else you learn? A, ca a cavalry leader? That's smart. Better guns? Very good. Grab the next one as well. More infantry, yes. Do 
Two at a time is very good. Very, very nice. And we'll do it again. Because we can. Experiority is not bad. I like the green. Green is good. I love that arm XP though. Never enough. Ah, now again, beating the crap out of. Him. So be it. So be it. It's fine. We can buy more guns too. If we really wanted to. We might need to. All right. So you are learning, and you, son. Well, you're also learning. Are they not feeling good over there? Alright, very good, very good. Grab some of that. Maybe get a North Carolinian uh, nuclear research facility. Yes, that'd be very nice. Still concerned over here. Better art is good. Grab that next level as well. Could use a spot of rubber. Uh, Florida? Uh, Cuba, why not? Actually, how are we doing over here? Get some more of this. Oh, 100%. That's pretty good, actually. Uh, 60%. I don't want to do it where there's a war going on right there. Go, Greenville. Oh, we're actually holding out there. Look at that. We had 100,000 losses. Virginia. Virginia. Ooh, that's not good. Enable plan. Increase f fuel storage. Yes, please. Ooh, do oh, they do oh, my goodness. They're doing force attack. Oh, boy. That ain't good for them. Oh boy. That's another combo, that sucks. Oh boy. Oh boy. Keep it up. Keep losing men. And maybe bombers too. Oh, do not. Oh! Claverns of America. Alrighty. Now we go. We're going to be independent with what we want to do here. Nice. Up between 9,000 New Orleans has capitulated. Confederacy of Texas. Kind of cool. I'm oh, sorry I'm taking so long with this. Just. Hello. What happened here? Yep, y'all learning stuff. Army offense is not bad. We already have a guy doing that though. Go infantry. You think they run out of stuff by now? They almost out of manpower too, so they out of guns. Arcade is gone. Next thing, land auction. Not bad. They love Sparta. Like, what is wrong with them? They're looking mighty weak here. Mighty, mighty weak. And they keep attacking. So, that's North or New England. So, uh, Shirt Legion Commandos, yes, please. Thank you very much. Go in. Yep, New England is definitely falling apart now. Get some more stability if you can. We got us wounded, so be it, so be it. 162,000. They cannot recover from this. There's no way they can, right? There's absolutely no way. Keep holding on out there. Their division is literally going to be dying there, so. Good. Maybe get some anti air eventually. Another infantry division. Cavalry specialist, maybe. Do that one too. And I'll go with that one, not the cavalry one, because I want those tactics as well. Can you guys actually win there by yourselves? Maybe. Maybe not. Uh, 
Eh, maybe we'll see. Get radar. Get some of that as well. They're almost at 200,000 losses and they still can't kill those off. Yeah, this ain't making too much sense here now, is it? Come on, start taking their territory. And start launching attacks. You gotta get a Roanoke? I said that well, was Roanoke, North Carolina. Oh, you best not kill them off. Commandos in Bay, Florida. We might as well get that one done. How are they not dead yet, man? Something I just do not understand. Also, as much as I want Bosco divisions, we need tactical bombers. Actually, maybe we shouldn't with close air support, but whatever. Well, they killed off that division. God dang it. Are you kidding me? Why are we so weak? Okay, so seriously, why are we so weak? Compared to everyone else. That doesn't make any sense. They're out of manpower. Land doctrine is b the grand battle plan doctrine really bad. Look how much how much do they have. I mean, I I get it. We're not supposed to be like extremely powerful, but like seriously, look at their strength here. For two divisions, this ain't much. This literally makes no sense. Yeah, I don't know. North Carolina is very very underpowered compared to its neighbors. All they have are infantry. Are they using like mass assault buffs or something? Mass assault doesn't have that many buffs though. You think after killing off their, all their manpower, they have not, not much else to use, but. I guess I'm wrong. Well, I guess we need more guns too now. There you go. No manpower, no guns. Yet yeah, they're still able to win. Oh, especially when they force attack. How can you not win your son? Yeah, I'm sorry, but I think the AI is cheating in this mod. Uh, this literally makes no sense. Look at that, look at that! And they still oppose a good amount of attack. What in the world is this about, man? If I were to attack here, they should easily be able to win. We should be able to e easily be able to win, at least. This makes no sense. Fighters. Eh, we're not using cast. 41, get some more output, maybe? Go up to the line here, maybe. I'm glad we went with ambush, sure, instead of the other one. There's a little bit more strength here. Need y'all to go that way as fast as possible. Invade Florida, and we finished off a lot of stuff up here. Let's go with flexible navy next. Better supply consumption. It's nice. Quite nice. Come on, man. Um, Toad artillery is nice. Not sure how much we're actually going to be using that one. Over here, we're looking pretty good overall. Uh, don't need that one. Maybe logistic companies? Maybe, maybe not. I need you guys to go right here, though. Keep shrinking. This part, so we can go over here to go to Salem or something. That's good. Keep defending, keep defending, keep defending. Go there. Ah, they're doing a little bit of force defense there, too. I know we're attacking into the mounds, but still. 
but still. You buying more guns yet? No. Makes this look just a wee bit better. You guys hold and such. Roanoke. It's fine. Go in. Please take out Salem. For the love of God, you should be able to take out Salem. It's either winning one of these two places, son. They ain't got much around there. Look at that. That division literally just died. Now nah, we're good. Um, man, Merck's, Merck's move would be very nice. Go right there. That's so much more important than anything else right now. If anything, go right there. You can still encircle them. And more convoys lost. Well, sucks. I'm just asking you to win, win, win somewhere. I'm not asking for much. Win. Well, at least this group is taken out. Uh, how many divisions do they stack in here? Oh my god. Yeah, this is a bit stupid. I'll be honest, this is not very fair. It's like North Carolina has nothing here. It's like absolutely nothing compared to everyone else around us. I mean, maybe I, I don't know the combo with perfectly, but like... <sighs> the starting position for us really sucks. It, it's really bad. It's really god-awful. Uh, there you go. Wait, we can't do this other stuff. Maybe it's just because we don't have enough of them. Maybe it looks be. Come on, come on, come on, interwar bombers. If we do have enough support, maybe we can make some of those as well. That'd be good. Got some naval bombers too. Railway guns, yes. Anti-air. Like once again, I apologize for not being able to go that far in this episode, but like, holy crap, this is just god awful. I don't know if I can really recommend doing North Carolina ever. This is so bad. You think you'd be able to beat someone up? I know it's mountains. You know, I get it. But Jesus Christ. Why is it so bad? I mean, you kill off 300,000 enemies and it's like nothing. Nothing's happened. Please, I just want a tile. You couldn't even take the goddamn tile, could you? Holy crap. How many god dang divisions do we need? Yeah, this ain't very balanced. Hey, not bad. I think you sunk something there. Anything else here? Yeah, that'd be good. Well, it's already June. Uh, we could grab that stuff. That's not bad to grab. Engineering. Ah, let me grab stuff again. Why not? Thank God. Thank God. Why did that take so long? I mean, look how weak they are. And they're still able to hold out against us. Screw that, man. We're going, we're going to go to Pound Town now. I prefer going to Pound Town on this side, but whatever. Um, anything else over here? Regionwide integration. War bonds, maybe? Two more cities for now. My goodness. 54,000. You think they lost enough guys, but no. They've not. Good, kill them all off. I don't know why we have to literally kill every every single man, literally every single man off here. This is a bit too much. How? How can you not win? Six versus three. We have air superiority. Yeah, the organization's not great, but look at the enemies. How is that even comparable? Is there some sort of like, secret nerf to us? Naval production? Might as well. Maybe that's what Doc got up with, though. Now everyone get back on the line. It's, oh my gosh, it just takes so long to kill anybody off. What do you have? Nothing? We, we have, yeah, we do have air superiority. 
Um, spiders, naval bombers, spiders, even a bomber now. Nice. Oh, who is this? Spider wing. I'll take it. Let's see if Mountaineer, that's good. There goes Massachusetts. Bunch of mass holes. Took Richmond. Oh boy. Virginia Beach is the capital. Which means these guys should be all cut off once we can get some ships through there. Oh crap. Well, we lost a con escorts. Oh. That's all we have left. they are veterans though. That's kind of nice. Mm. Yeah, I'll probably edit that stuff off screen. You don't feel like dealing with it now. And they're still doing force defense, and we still can't take them out. I mean, bro. Like, bro. Are you kidding me? You have 13% strength left. Take it from multiple directions. We have an intel advantage, and it's still not enough? Yeah, I don't know, man. I, I got a really question. Like, why is North Carolina so bad? Is, it, is, it, is there something stupid about them? Are they just dumb as rocks? Why, why did that take so long? I get Virginia's got more manpower. Probably more industry than North Carolina, but like, that much? Well, in my opinion, that was took way too long. Now, as much as I want to ally a good old Huey and partition the South, or partition, we're absolutely going to attack the Jeffersonians. Absolutely. Uh, this will give a, a war goal against Louisiana and Georgia. Well, I guess Georgia's next. Could be worse. Doesn't seem like anyone really wants to attack us too much. Pull out of Arkansas, Mississippi. So you guys, not bad. You guys are on the other side, not bad. Um, train. And uh, who else can we go to war with? Oh, Tennessee. Oh, Tennessee might not too be too bad attack actually either. But that's going to take probably so long to do. Alvin York, the Democratic, huh? We got a lot of divisions. Well, you know what? Georgia can wait. And we'll go to war with the good old uh, Tennessee. You volunteer stay in the next episode. But if you enjoyed this weirdly long, or not really weirdly long, but just like really awkward video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, or ask and figure out who North Carolina is named after, and I'll see you tomorrow in the next episode. Thanks for watching, have a great rest of your day.